Hey what's up everyone, so welcome back to another video and like I promised on my previous build for Windows 10 devices um, today I'm gonna show you Skype preview for Windows 10 mobile and uh, I'm gonna show you fast the build I'm using because this build, uh, this build, this Skype preview it's not available on the Windows 10 official so I'm showing you that it, it, it works in this build so I'm not sure if it works in previous builds um, let's go into open Skype and see and this Skype preview you can't download it through the store um, this is the new Skype but let's let's show you how to get this application so I'm gonna leave a link to the to the application on the description and you go download it through the through, through your uh, mobile phone through your PC and then copy into your uh, phone it doesn't matter just get it download it and get uh, into the phone I copied it into my device, I copied then into downloads and here is the app, appk, app, appx, not appk <laughs> uh, but to install it, go first in settings update and security, let's, yeah, it's focused update and security and then for developers and choose developer mode because if you have windows store apps or side load apps you can't install it and choose developer mode and then you can install it when you select developer mode just come back here and press once into, into the PPX and it will uh, say here and pop up if you want to install or not let's see if it will appear yeah we'll do like to install Skype review from Skype review from Skype <laughs> but how I have it installed it's uh, I didn't install it and after that if it will install after it will install it will take like two three minutes after uh, it will appear in your applications then you might want to restart your phone for it to work prop properly and also install it on uh, internal memory and not on the SD card because if you install it on the SD card it will crash many times uh, I, ha I had it on the SD card and it was crashing many times and after I moved to internal storage it doesn't crash maybe sometimes it's crashed but it doesn't crash like most of the times, let's uh, see. Let's show you that it's in the internal memory. Uh, where is it? Skype preview. Come on, appear, appear. Because how it's uh, even the previous Skype, uh, you sh you should install it on the internal memory. Yeah, it's here. Skype preview. Again, I'm on this device and not on the SD card. I had it on the SD card, but then I moved it to internal memory because it was crashing sometimes. This is the application. Uh, he, you have you have here the dark theme. It's not really dark because it's like a grayish version, but if you want to have to have the white version, I'm seeing my face here. Let's, <laughs> uh, but if you want to have the white version, you must change the co the color from the phone itself, uh, which I hope Microsoft kind of brings uh, an option to change to light theme or dark theme between the application itself. And because as you can see, it has the here you can see better the um, hamburger menu and the um, lateral bar here you can press on the hamburger menu or you can press here oh okay what now we don't have not dot hamburger menu <laughs> uh, but you go into settings and before the settings were very messed up now they are better because they were messed up because let me show you here uh, they were showing me in skype all my contacts from my phone from facebook contacts from Skype contacts, it was showing me all the contacts in the Skype application with the previous build. And now you can see it has an op option to choose, don't use my address book. So it uses only uh, people that you have on your own Skype. So the setting, instant messages um, from anyone, incoming calls, blah, blah, blah. Uh, now with that lateral bar disappeared, <laughs> I don't know how to get it back. Uh, let's switch back to to the dark team because in the light team it's not so visible on the on the screen as I can see and yeah it's disappeared and here if we, if we press an about um, it shows you the this is the version version I'm using then we here get also setup which setup I'm not sure what it, what it does let's find out Skype better with friends uh, I don't want this. Yeah, set up it to put your phone number, send feedback, what's new, and here if you press new conversation, it will create like a group, which I created the group, uh, I created here a group, but I left, but 
if when you create a group or you create the, someone sends you a message if you press here on these three buttons you can add people to this group or view profile but here there's no buttons and when you press on the conversation let's when you press in the conversation you have again view profile add to favorites and leave conversation but there is no option to to delete the conversation and now it crashed as you can see uh, it how it's a preview and not even a beta it it crashes but let's go again if you press on it you view profile add to favorites and leave conversation but you don't have a button to delete the conversation leave conversation don't ask again see here how it's not see not uh, like the same nivel <laughs> leave and but again left, if i left that conversation and i don't have a button to delete which is a bit meh like for example here this conversation i have with my girlfriend i don't have to to delete this uh, conversation for example you can send here the emojis you have this little bu button here which i hope they kind of make it this bigger because it's so small so your hand <laughs> my, i mean the fingers are big so i hope they make it a bit bigger bigger here are the power woman and it takes a bit time until it loads all these uh, big emojis then here also more emojis uh, it's not like emojis these are like gifs see here with this one i never used this angry birds or maybe some and it takes more time to 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 load but anyway here you when you press on this uh, it will uh, ask you to to send you a bill a uh, bill <laughs> uh, image then you can here you can type something uh, hello test test and you if you press on the, this button it will s send and you can press also on this button to send to send and it's, you can see hello test and it's sended and then this is uh, more or less everything unread i don't have yeah unread all but and then you have search skype uh, you search for a contact and then you, here you have contacts it shows you all the contacts and sh shouldn't sh show online contacts and then when you go in your profile finally you can uh, put your status to online and way do not disturb invisible or even offline uh, then you can also uh, mood change your there uh, add a contact number and account manage there uh, but anyway this is the new skype uh, it's a bit better it's uh, it's smooth to use it crashes sometimes here and there as you saw there it crashed but it's very usable and uh, i like how the way microsoft is going to with this skype uh, version but i hope they bring a button to to delete the conversation and also a option in the settings to change between the light team or dark team and yeah this is the build um hope you can also install it and enjoy it and yeah thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next one